Hi guys, welcome back to my Pokemon Fire at LP. This is episode 67. Today I'm taking on Bruno of the Elite Four. Through rigorous training, people and Pokemon can become stronger without limit. I've lived and trained with my fighting Pokemon, and that will never change. MGS, we will grind you down with our superior power. Hoo ha! So Elite Four Bruno, he's got mostly fighting Pokemon, and he's also got some rock and ground Pokemon like Onix, which you can see right here. This is his lead Pokemon, level 51. So this shouldn't be a problem for SMP. It's gonna go for the stab and super effective pedal dance, which will completely annihilate the Onix, and it goes down. And next is a Hitmonchan, so uh, I'll give Zion its chance to battle. So go Zion. So I'm gonna go for a Sleep Powder first, but Hitmonchan outspeeds, went for the Rock Tomb, which is times four, super effective, so Zion didn't get a chance to do anything. So this time I will switch to Desert Fox, which is part flying. So I'm going to go for the fly now. Hitmonchan's Rock 2 misses. And Fox flying on top of Hitmonchan. And Hitmonchan's going for the counter attack. It caught me completely off guard there. And down goes Fox, so this is not a very good start. I've already lost two Pokemon in the beginning of the battle, so I'm gonna go for SMP this time. As Hitmonchan going for a Sky Uppercut, which is resisted due to SMP's part poison typing. And now I'm gonna go for a Petal Dance. Hopefully it'll be enough to take down Hitmonchan, but it's not. So Bruno uh, goes for a full restore, his first of the battle. SMP continuing the pedal dance, this is his second um, time doing it. And it's Hitmonchan, uh, another Sky Uppercut, not gonna do very much. We're both doing about the same amount of damage to each other. I think it'll just come down to uh, SMP's um, confusion. So I'm gonna try and Moonlight now, right after this Sky Uppercut. That did about 30 damage, um, approximately, so I'm fortunate enough to get off a of Moonlight, even while confused. That will bring SMP back to almost full health. Okay, so now I'm going to keep pedal dancing as the Sky Uppercut is still being resisted by SMP. But uh, SMP hit itself um, during the confusion, so I need to get off another Moonlight. Hopefully, and yes, uh, SMP did snap out of the confusion, which is what I really needed. And now SMP gonna gain a lot of health back from Moonlight. So now I get to go for a pedal dance. And Hitmonchan survives. Uh, the counter fails. So Hitmonchan, gonna go for another Sky Uppercut. It's not gonna do a whole lot. So uh, SMP is gonna finish off this Hitmonchan with another pedal dance. So Hitmonchan's going down. Now here comes a Hitmonlee. And I'll leave SMP in. As SMP um, became confused due to the fatigue of the pedal dance, so I need to get off another Moonlight. Luckily for me, uh, Hitmonlee's Mega Kick missed. As SMP is able to get off another Moonlight. And that's really good news. And I'm just going to see how much this acid will do. Hitmonlee, second Mega Kick miss. 
So SMP snapping out of the confusion yet again, getting off the acid. So I didn't get any defense drops. And this time, Hitmonlee does hit the Mega Kick. As it did a little more than half. So another Mega Kick will probably take out my SMP. And here, here comes another one. So uh, SMP is going down. So I need to s uh, switch in Blue Celebi this time because it's got a lot of physical bulk. As Himonlee is not holding back any more kicks, it's just gonna use another Mega Kick, and that did quite a lot. It did about half. So this time Hitmonlee is going for the Burk Break. Blue Celebi living like the beast that it is. Getting off another Surf, so Hit Hitmonlee's going down. Now Bruno's gonna send out a Machamp. So I'm thinking about what to do here. And I'm just gonna leave Blue Celebi in. And I need really need to heal it right at this moment. So I'm just going to go into my bag, give it a max potion. And it's back to full health. As Machamp going for the Rock Tomb, it's unstabbed, so it's not going to do very much. And I don't care too much about Blue Celebi's speed being lower because it's not that fast to begin with. And I don't want to Toxic it because it might have guts, so I'm just going to see how much the Surf will do. But Machamp going for the Cross Chop and gets the critical hit. So. Uh, Bruno is hacking me out here. So I'm just gonna go into Mary. I'm only down to two Pokemon. So Mary gonna go for Cross Chop, hopefully getting a crit, but I didn't. But my champ's gonna get off a bulk up. Which isn't good because it raises its defense, so hopefully this one crits it. But I don't get the crit. So my champ gonna get off a bulked up cross chop, and this is getting ugly. As um, I'm only down to top, so I really need to revive my team. As my champ is uh, activating its citrus berry to recover some health back, so I'm going to um, pull out some revives. And let's see, I will revive Zion because I need Psychic. Machamp going for Cross Chop. And that takes out Tup. But uh, Machamp got paralyzed. So I'm gonna go ahead and send out Zion. And hopefully this Psychic takes it out. But it doesn't. I got the special defense drop. And my champ misses the rock tomb. And I got really fortunate there as my champ. I mean, as Bruno recovers uh, my champ's HP with a full restore. So now I'm going for another psychic. Now that his special defense is lowered. A bit, uh, but. Uh, my champ survived. This is another rock tomb. So I'm just gonna finish it off with a silver wind. So my champ is going down. Zion growing to level 48. Which is nice. Now here comes his final Pokemon, Onyx. So now I'm just going to go for a sleep powder, put it right to sleep, while I uh, revive more of my Pokemon back from fainting. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, revive SMP. And Onyx woke up, going for double edge, and that will almost take out Zion. 
as Onyx outspeeds, probably from the speed tie that it won, is able to take out um, my Zion, so it's all up to SMP now. And I'm going for the Hyper Potion to heal up SMP. Onyx goes for Earthquake. That doesn't do a whole lot, but it gets off a second Earthquake. Now SMP gonna finish off Onyx with this Petal Dance, which is times 4 super effective and stab. That Onyx doesn't stand a chance. Onyx going down. So SMP gaining 1,249 experience, and I've defeated Bruno in a very epic and hard fought battle. Why? How could I lose? My job is done. Go face your next challenge. I see he's taking the loss very hard. So before I move on, I really need to revive and heal up um, my whole team, really, because Bruno really um, 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 took a beat. Um, Bruno really beat them down really hard with his fighting Pokemon. Sp most uh, specifically his Machamp. So I'm going to revive my entire team here. And um, I'll be right back in just a moment. I'm back from taking a important phone call. So um, you guys can feel free to uh, stop watching this video. Uh, I know um, watching me heal up my Pokemon isn't the most exciting thing to watch as um, I'm going to uh, heal up my entire team to get ready for the next uh, battle. So um, comment, like, sub if you enjoyed watching it. And I'm just going to prepare for Agatha. So um, Bruno was the toughest Elite Four uh, member so far as he actually almost wiped out my entire team. There were some pretty scary moments, uh, but I was able to somehow get the victory due to um, hacks going my way when Machamp missed some rock tombs on Zion, which got really um, tense, really uh, nerve-wracking. But Zion is very epic. I'm glad that Zion's on the team. It always gives me good luck. So I'm about almost done uh, healing up my entire party, so only Tub needs to be healed right now. So here's the Super Potion. So they've all uh, healed up, and it's time to head out. So I'm going to be waiting in front of Agatha for the next episode. So I'm going to prepare my first Pokemon, and she specializes in ghosts, so it'll have to be Zion taking over the front position. So alright, I'll see you guys next time.